Hello everyone. Welcome to latest update program. The topic of discussion is first phase of Genome India project completed. This topic relates to science and technology subject. India has completed the first phase of its ambitious Genome India project, GIP, cataloging the entire gene sequences of 10,000 individuals from 83 population groups. The project aims to create a comprehensive database that can be used for personalized medicine, diagnostics, and understanding the evolutionary history of different population groups within India. Before moving further, an important announcement. The next offline batch of the IASGS Foundation course, Prelims plus Mains, is starting soon at Drishti IAS, Noida. The English medium batch will begin on 7th May at 8 a.m. and the Hindi medium batch will start on 26th of April at 6 p.m. For more details, contact 87501875501. Now let's discuss about Genome India Project, the Department of Biotechnology, DBT, initiated the ambitious Genome India Project on 3rd January 2020. It is led by the Centre for Brain Research at the Indian Institute of Science, Bengaluru, and involves collaboration with 20 institutions. The project involves whole genome sequencing and data analysis of 10,000 individuals to understand disease nature in the Indian population and develop predictive diagnostic markers. This huge data set of 8 petabytes will be stored at the Indian Biological Data Center, IBDC, in Faridabad. Now moving on to key highlights, the data was collected from blood samples, capturing the full DNA sequence of individuals to understand genetic diversity within India. Despite 99.9% .9 similarity in the genetic makeup of all humans, the small 0.1% difference is what makes each individual unique in appearance, behavior and health. The GIP database offers insights into genetic predispositions to diseases, contributing to the development of personalized medicines tailored to individuals. The project also emphasizes the role of genetics in understanding the spread of certain diseases in specific populations, such as diabetes, in India. Now let's discuss about genome sequencing. Genome sequencing is a process of determining the complete DNA sequence of an organism's genome. A genome is a complete set of DNA that contains all of the genes of an organism. It involves figuring out the order of bases, adenine, cytosine, guanines, and thymine that make up an organism's DNA. It is supported by automated DNA sequencing methods and computer software to assemble massive sequence data. There are two methods of genome sequencing, clone-by-clone -clone approach and whole genome shotgun approach. Now moving on to previous year question, 2017. With reference to agriculture in India, how can the technique of genome sequencing, often seen in the news, be used in the immediate future? 2017. Genome sequencing can be used to identify genetic markers for disease resistance and drought tolerance in various crop plants. This technique helps in reducing the time required to develop new varieties of crop plant. It can be used to decipher the host pathogen relationships in crops. Select the correct answer using the code given below. A. 1 only. B. 2 and 3 only. C. 1 and 3 only. D. 1, 2 and 3. Send the answer for this question in the comment section. Thanks for watching. For more informative content, like, share and subscribe. And do not forget to press the bell icon to get the notifications.